So really quickly, I wanted to show you guys how to do a full face of foundation in less than five minutes. The other day I was running so late to work and I was, oh my gosh, my face is breaking out. As you can see, you know, not everybody has good days with their skin. Everybody breaks out. So I wanted to show you guys how I can do my foundation in less than five minutes. I'm going to show you the products that I use that work really well when you're in a time constraint. Are they the products that I use every day? Some of them are and one of them isn't usually. I don't usually use stick foundation on a daily basis. But when I'm running late, it's the easiest, it's the most full coverage, and it works the best. All right, so I already prepped and primed my face. I used Kate Somerville's Exfoliate Glow Moisturizer, and I used Benefit's Pore Professional Primer to make sure that my skin stays matte. As you can see, it does look like my skin's pretty irritated, so I'm just gonna go in. This is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Stick Foundation in the color Medium Neutral. It looks like this. I like stick foundations for when I'm running late. There's nothing better because you just do like line, like a line of it and you can blend it out through your face. There's no crazy liquids that you have to blend and use beauty blenders for. It works really fast. So really quickly, I just do usually three on one cheek, three on the other, and then I just fill in as needed on my face. Like that kind of probably looks crazy to you, but I just, this is how I do um, stick foundation. Everybody I feel like does it differently. So I take my stick foundation and then I take my Tarte Bamboo brush. This was $40 at Ulta and I just literally brush it into my skin. Which is funny because I don't usually use a brush with foundation but I will use it if I'm using a stick foundation because it's not super, um, you know, like sticky or anything like that, it's going to go really well with the product that you're using. Next, to keep it full coverage, I am gonna go in with my Tarte Shape Tape. I am not going to skip this if I'm running late, just for the pure fact that it will help cover anything, and it's really one of the things that you should not skimp out on, just because if you wanna be full coverage, you're having kind of a bad skin day, and you wanna you know, feel confident throughout your day, this is a really good add on. You won't even think about it after. You'll just have your makeup done. You'll be like, wow, I'm so glad I put on concealer because if I didn't, I don't feel like my foundation would have looked this flawless or anything like that. Next, I'm just gonna set my face with Makeup Revolution's Illuminating Fixing Spray. I set my brush also with the same. I simply take my Becca um, champagne pop highlighter because it's one of my favorites and if I'm running late I don't care I still need to glow like I cannot not glow look at that that's so insane that's only two um, swipes of it and it's crazy because you just don't realize what a difference a little highlight can make on your face and the reason I'm getting such an intense highlight is because I wet my brush do the milk mustache and I think even filming this did not take me more than five minutes usually filming elongates the process a little bit more but nope this is full coverage foundation, highlighted. I didn't take the time to set the concealer because if you're running late, it's not a necessary step. It's just something that kind of locks it in all day. But I think that you can, you know, pick and choose what you want to do. Do you want to bronze your face? Like I would say after foundation, pick between a couple things. I would recommend concealing, but okay, do I want to bronze my face? Do I want to use blush and like make myself look alive? Or do I want to highlight? I'm a highlight kind of girl, but it's up to you. To finish up this look, I'm just going to put on Maxi Ash. It's hard for me to really love lipsticks that are not liquid. But I really do like this one. And next I'm just going to top it with Becca's... Um, Liquid Crystal Lip Topper Glow Gloss. And this is meant to go on top of other lipsticks. So that's something that I would probably do once I got to work. If I'm running late, I always put on lipstick. I never leave the house without it on. Um, but 
it's kind of like I said, your personal preference. What do you do? Because I find that I spend too much time on my eyeshadow and my lashes that by the time I get to foundation, I'm like, crap, I have five minutes before I have to leave the house and my face looks like a hot mess. So it's really up to you. This is just a nice look to make you look alive, make you look, you know, kind of radiant, glowy, and get you through your day full coverage. You're not gonna shine. You're not gonna do any of that. You're gonna be all covered and you're gonna just feel so much better if you take that extra five minutes, even if you're running late, to kind of conceal and do whatever you want. Whatever makes you feel best, whether it's highlighting, bronzing, putting on blush, you know, you gotta pick your poison. But I hope that this helped you guys because if you're a high maintenance kind of person um, like me, you might be running late quite often, probably more often than not. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this quick and easy five minute foundation tutorial. Um, let me know what you guys want to see more of, what you want to see less of. Comment down below. Give me some ideas. I love to hear back from you guys. Um, I find it very interesting and I love when people comment and just let me know what they thought of the video. So be sure to follow us on social Social media. The biggest one right now is Instagram at X O M E L L A B L O G underscore X O M E L A blog underscore. Pinterest is big too, X O M E L A blog. And just follow the journey because it's going to be interesting. I can't wait to show you guys some super glam Christmas looks. Those are coming next because time's running out. Christmas will be here before we know it. We need to perfect these looks right now because we don't want to be running late Christmas Eve <laughs> trying out glitter glue and all those fun things. No, you need to be wrapping presents and you just need to have your makeup look on point. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again in my next video.